Well, the IRS says hackers used one of their online services to gain access to personal information from more than 100,000 taxpayers, including tax returns. Local 12 troubleshooter Howard Ain joins us now with what you need to know. Howard, what do we need to know? Yes, Brad, the Internal Revenue Service says criminals used non-IRS sources to get names, social security numbers, dates of birth, and street addresses in order to gain access to tax returns. But most of us are not affected by that hacking. That's because the thieves gained access to tax returns through the IRS's link called Get Transcripts. That link is used by taxpayers to get copies of their old tax returns. So if you never use that link that called Get Transcripts, then you have nothing to worry about. The hacking was discovered by the IRS in mid-May, and the Get Transcript application was shut down and will remain disabled until new security measures are added. The IRS says hackers first started getting into the system back in February, and in all, about 200,000 attempts were made from questionable email domains. It says about 100,000 attempts were successful, and it's offering those taxpayers free credit monitoring. Letters are being mailed out this week to all 200,000 taxpayers affected. Howard Ain, Local 12 Troubleshooter. Howard, thank you very much.